Hi, I'm Luke Corum with the Puyallup Sumner Chamber of Commerce. I'm here with Laura Jackson, who's Hello. running for Pierce County Council, District 1. Hi, Laura. Hello. I have a few questions for you today. Sure. Uh, in two minutes or less, describe yourself. Touch on any community involvement and why are you running for office? Sure, sure. Um, so let's just start off. I'm a custom compliance. Uh, I work in custom compliance, which is like import, export, um, U.S. regulations. Uh, my I consider Pierce County my home base, and that's because in the 1990s, my parents bought a home here in South Hill. And um, after my dad retired from the Army, uh, they settled here. And so I've either lived here or I've been visiting here uh, since that time. And I've watched it grow. I watched it grow from a place, a, forest, a forested area with no sidewalks to what it is now, a thriving, bustling uh, town. When, when I came back here about three years ago with my daughter to reestablish my roots, um, I noticed that you know, I'm very concerned about the growth and if the infrastructure is matching the growth and balancing it and um, making sure it gets reinvested into the community and for the residents. So, um, uh, which is why some of my priorities are transportation, like looking for ways to ease traffic, whether that's in uh, advocating for local job creation that provides living wages, you know, and or it's also um, making sure that we have the, you know, road networking and making sure we have like different routes that you can travel going to the same place. Also, it means advocating for mass transit. Um, and investing in our public spaces like parks and uh, protecting our residents. So that also includes renters' rights, which I'm a huge advocate for. Good. What would you say is the most important issue in your race? So for my priorities, I'm going to say that um, what I hear mostly is about um, easing the traffic, um, especially here in South Hill. I hear that in Bonnie Lake. Um, we now have the... Uh, the bridge that was recently closed, um, which is uh, may cause some like more traffic on 162 and 410. Um, yeah, so I want to say that easing traffic and making sure we bring, like uh, I know that the county council has hired an economic development director recently. It was at the end of June, um, who is uh, that's her job is to try to bring businesses into uh, Pierce County. And we just wanna you know, advocate and make sure that um, the jobs that are coming in are living wages, so it's not just the bare minimum. Um, and, and that you can afford to live in a place and spend more time with your family. Hmm. How specifically would you support the business community? So, I think that you know, all of happy, happy residents make happy local businesses. So I, you know, I, I definitely think local businesses is very important um, in a, to make a community, uh, you know, still thrive and bustle, and it provides some of the local jobs that happen in this area. So I believe that um, again, addressing the transportation issue, um, and also uh, it's also with uh, making sure that the residents do have that time to go and spend, and do have that time to. Um, uh, do have the wages that can help them spend um, in their area. Well, good. Well, thank you, Laura, for coming down today, and uh, thanks for taking time with us. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Yeah.